Okay, here's a good one. This is a topic that's been plaguing the Halo community for years. Ever since, um, what's it called? After Halo Reach, I think. Yeah, after Halo Reach. The concept of playable elites. Obviously, this grunt is friendly, as you can see. We're playing Halo 2. We're playing as the Arbiter, the second protagonist in the Halo games. 2 and 3. So what does he have that Master Chief doesn't? Well, in Halo 2, he has a purple HUD, as you can see in the corners of the video. And he has, instead of a flashlight, active camo. So we hit it right now, we're invisible. This is only for Halo 2. In Halo 3, he doesn't have any of these abilities. He has a teal, greenish color HUD in comparison to Master Chief's blue HUD. But that's about it. They both have flashlights in Halo 3. Arbiter spawns in with an energy sword and a carbine, I think, in Halo 3. So... The elites, why people love playing as them or want to play as them is because they're basically the alien counterpart to the Spartans like Master Chief goes. They're like eight feet tall and they are known to easily kill Spartans. That's just it. And they're not even the best covenant alien soldier there is because the best covenant alien soldier there is is called a prophet prelate. But those are extremely rare, and they're never encountered in the games. So the toughest enemies that can match a Spartan head-to-head -head and everything is going to be the elites because they can drive and stuff. Hunters can't do that despite them being even more powerful. And there's no playable brutes either. But the brutes are just like kind of trashy outside of Atriox. But the elites kind of have that discipline, samurai attitude crap, and they have all that covenant tech. They're the ones that built all the alien tech, in most cases. But yeah. Personally, if they did, I would love to see like a different HUD style. Because I love the purple HUD in this game, because it's unique compared to Master G's blue. But Halo 3's Arbiter, I didn't like his HUD that much because it looked too similar. It's hard to differentiate between the two. Because the teal color looks closely to blue, and it's hard telling the difference between the two. Whereas, a uh, Spartan player that plays as Master Chief is going to have a blue color HUD, and someone that plays as the Elite is going to have a purple color HUD. But I think they also changed it because the Arbiter in Halo 3 leaves the Covenant. Same with the Elites, so they probably that's why they don't have the purple color HUD. But yeah, now if they made it in, hey, let's say Halo Infinite, that's a bug. Why isn't he throwing the grenade? Weird. Okay, let's say uh, Halo Infinite, they made uh, at least playable. The HUD should definitely be red, and I'm going to tell you why. The banished colors are red, and a lot of the elites, such as the Silent Shadow and crap, they're already red in general, even when they were part of the Covenant. So that would make sense. And you have to think like guys like the Blade Master with a red energy sword. So I it would make a lot more sense if his HUD was red. But I would have actually liked to see more elites with the reddish armor and the reddish energy swords and reddish plasma weapons instead of it looking like um, they're still part of the Covenant. But that's just the personal opinion I have. Let me know in the comments if you like elites. Or better yet, would you want us to be able to play as Prometheans or play as Brutes even? Comment who would you want to play as in Halo, whether it's campaign or multiplayer, outside of Spartans. Thank you for watching.